Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Clark's Farms. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, it all helps. This week we are doing a bit of a fabrication job, it's fixing a problem we've had in the farm for years. It's one of the drinkers up in the mountain, um, I was always just sitting in blocks and then I was sitting on the ground for a while and it was just not the right job so we took at it and we've made a good job of it now. Um, but yeah, so let's get at it. So today I am back on a bit of a fabrication job here. Um, we have an awful lot of drinkers to go in. Um, in the field reset last year, the hippo drinkers are going to it. There's drinkers to go on, on up the mountain, and there's drinkers in the field that we are getting ready for reseeding as well. To do. So, um, my plan is now is to make a mould for a concrete base for them, so we'll be able to use the same mould each time, just bolt it together, or bolt it apart, or well, I think we're going to bolt it together anyway, um, and then just take it apart when the, when the concrete hardens. Um, so I'm going to make it up now, add a bit of box action and steel I have. Um, here's the drawing here. My plan is to have it sort of like two L shapes and just bolt the two of them together then. Um, yeah, so I've hooked about the yard there and found this out bit of box action. There's another one up there too if I need this. I probably will need it to be fair. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna. I worked up my lengths here now, so I'm gonna cut up the lengths and go from that. So I just shot into the higher shop there, to left the console to cut the steel, and they've got a new machine in. They say just try it out, see what see what I think of it. It's a battery powered console. I didn't even know the made such thing. Um, yeah, it's supposed to be a great tool. So I'm gonna test it out here now. Um, the battery on it has a rapid charge, it'll charge the battery within 15 minutes and it's supposed to be fairly long lasting but look we'll we'll, um, we'll give it a go here and see what we think of it it's 82 volt so I should have enough poke on it like but yeah I'll give it a go here and see what it's like So, finished cutting all that steel there. I done all the cuts with the console. I would near say the blade must turn faster or something because it seems to cut a lot quicker. Um, and the battery is on 56%. So it does a fair bit of cutting on a, on a, on a battery. Great handy job, great, great tool. Um, so yeah, so they have that available for hire. Um, but yeah, once like if you were doing a job out in a field and you that and the cordless welder, so it eliminates any need for a generator. Very very handy. Yeah, so we'll get the he's all put together now and get the welder out. Um, <laughs>
Well, that's the first one welded up. Um, not nice stuff to weld at all. It's really like box tracks and that. Um, yeah, the stick's burning, burning through it very, very easy. But we'll get it done anyway. So, I called away from this job yesterday, but I'm back at it now. Um, I cut up a little bit of spinel aluminium we had. Um, cut it now. And that'll cover that panel there now. So, I'm just gonna screw it on it now. That'll be the first of the panels on. I get the rest of them all welded up. Um, so yeah, we'll fix these on here. Then we'll just have to work out the bolting them together. Um, I'm thinking a couple of weeks of angle iron, belt them all together. But we'll see, we'll get these panels on first. Right, so that's all the plates cut and screwed on. Just gonna set all the air here now and hopefully work out what I'm about in the air. So, with these two sitting the air here now, um, the plan is we're gonna we've got these wee bits off because from when we were making the bracket for the for the bail clamp, the soft hands. Just gonna weld them on there like that. Leaves in, we can tear the chain around if we're lifting that, and, and also if it does, if we do find them hard to get off and the concrete's hard, we can also bat that with the hammer. So it'll serve two purposes there. So we'll weld this on here now. So, this is the finished project. Definitely not the prettiest looking thing in the world, but it should do the job, hopefully. What I ended up doing was welding a nut on here, and a bigger nut, act as a washer. Uh, I just put a bolt through here, done it, top and bottom on both sides. So that leaves all tight together. Then whenever the concrete's hardened, just loosen them two bolts, do it on both sides, and knock them off. The welds are like the brake force. The welds are probably like the brake force, yeah. But, should do the job lovely. Hopefully. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know whether you get at it today or not, but we'll get a mix of concrete done up, and get the first anchor sat on it and see what it's like. So, that Gavin just here again this morning. Where is it? There he is. Uh, gonna stick a mix of concrete on here and get blanker sorted once and for all.
<laughs> so, that's him way out the mole there and the first mix. I'm going to run up here in the quad and see how it goes. I'd say we're going to probably need to put an album mix on, but we'll get up and get our level and see how it goes. So, we're up here in the mountain now. Uh, we're just going to set it up. Putting these big stones in here just for like it's only a base and that has to. Um, it'll just save us some concrete. Yeah. Yeah, see what's better here. Um so we were set up here now. Download the level up on the phone. I forgot to take the level is, but she's all set spot on, so we'll throw a bit of concrete in here now and see how it goes. So that's the first mix in. I threw an all out stone in there just to fill it up again. Um, yeah, we're throwing our mix on here now. And I'll not need all that, but we need some for the base of the gates in here. And that post there. Um, so, yeah, so we're not going to waste. See the bubbles going the middle? Yeah, right enough. So that's the second load in. We're all leveled off and all. Um, now, just have to figure out what well, do we weigh sitting in the drink right now so it concretes it in as well? No. Yes. I'll leave it sit for an hour. 
fucking sink. I know, but at least then it'll, it'll settle in. I want to settle in cricket. Yeah, that's true. Maybe, maybe we didn't ask hard before you did anything. Else. I know, but as Dad said to me, is just set the drink on top of it so the, conquer, or the cows can't knock it off. Jesus. Right, if you set that on now, it'll sink. And you can't guarantee it's going to sink that Mmm, that's true. Ash will come back in an hour and see what it's like. I thought we'd had enough concrete left over for the gates, but apparently not. So, that's an on-mission, I suppose. Right, you need to go back out of here. Okay. Yeah, you lift it, let's see. Aye. Yeah, good job, Charlie, yeah. Different Jeep. Oh, corner broke off. Yep. So, turned out to be an absolute super job. Mole is perfect. Um, yeah, so you'll just have to shorten the pipe now and connect it up. But definitely well pleased with that. That'll be the first mole of many. Right guys, unfortunately that is all we have time for this week. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And drop any comments below that you have about the video. Um, it all helps. Don't forget we have a new video out every Sunday. Um, there's plenty of videos there if you want to watch back on them. Um, also check out the website for any merch. And yeah, that's us for this week. All the best now. Good luck.